Welcome ladies and gentlemen. If you haven't already, go to otm.boards.net and register for free and be able to comment on WWE and TNA news and rumors. If you don't register, all you can do is view. You cannot comment, you cannot leave your opinions on everything. There's also, you can view YouTube videos, you can look at Facebook discussions, Twitter tweets by On The Mat and On The Mat followers, you can view other videos, you can discuss about topics and upcoming events, and you can also vote on polls on hot topics. Now right now the hot topic is, as of Tuesday, it, Tuesday night, it came to everyone that CM Punk has walked out on WWE. Monday night, around 6 p.m., CM Punk went to Vince McMahon and said, I'm going home. He got on the plane, he flew to Chicago, now he's sitting on his big comfy couch. Now, the reason for this is two reasons from what I've found out. One, he didn't like that Batista returned at the Royal Rumble, won the Royal Rumble, and now is main eventing WrestleMania. He feels that he worked his ass off this entire year since he's lost the WWE Championship to Dwayne last Royal Rumble. And that he should have won the Royal Rumble and he should be res main eventing WrestleMania. I sort of disagree. Um, I'm not too big of a CM Punk fan. Uh, he might have worked his ass off. He might have had some good matches. But I don't think that he should have won the Royal Rumble. And I don't think that he should have main evented WrestleMania or should. Now, Batista winning the Royal Rumble really wasn't a smart decision to please your employees with the WWE. I think Roman Reigns should have won it. Um, but it's sort of too soon for him, too. But uh, CM Punk also didn't like the direction that the writing team was putting his character and lying to the fans that he had a concussion. CM Punk did get banged up. He did take a concussion test Monday morning and he did pass. But uh, the creative team wanted to push the fact that he had a concussion when he didn't. So CM Punk throwing another 10 per tantrum once more. He quits WWE with only four or five months left on his contract. Um, not too professional of a new move, not too smart of a move. Um, if I was him, I would work to WrestleMania, then ask Vince McMahon, hey, the next two months, can I just have off the rest of my contract? I'm sick. I'm beat up. I feel like crap. I just need the time off. I can't be pushed no more. I've been going full throttle for the past three to four years. Um, that would have been the more professional way, would have been the more smarter way than just leaving. But um, people are talking if this is a work or not. I don't believe this is a work. Um, if it is a work, it's kind of not that great of a work, I guess you can say. it's. They could do a lot better of a work than just him not being on TV and saying, oh, I quit, you know. But um, that's pretty much it. Uh, if you haven't already, I said it in the beginning, go to otm.boards.net. Uh, on there, it I started up. Uh, the website officially starts 11.05 p.m. Eastern Time at the end of Monday Night Raw this coming Monday, February 3rd. It is... WWE and TNA news and rumors, and there's a bunch of other stuff that you can participate in, but you can only participate in it if you register. Registering is for free. If you don't register, all you can do is go there and view the stuff. But if you register, you can comment on everything, show your opinion for everything. You can be in the discussions on the and vote in polls and everything on the on the forum. So if you haven't already, go over there. And you can also like our Facebook fan page at facebook.com slash otm.boards.net. You can also follow me on Twitter, which is the OTM Twitter account. It's also my personal Twitter account um, at twitter.com slash realtylergets.